I'm Matt from Geotactical Solutions, and today I'm going to cover calibrating the compass for the 500 SEM GPS tactical camera. The SC2C compass module uh, allows us to orient the camera and understand which direction we were looking at when we took the photo. We bring that into the mapping environment, it's going to show up as a field of view cone that shows us the general direction we were looking in. So we use two methods of calibrating the compass. The first one being general, your basic use, and the second technique being a more refined calibration for use of the laser rangefinder. So to begin, first thing we want to do is go into the menu and go to the expanded settings tab, and then select compass calibration on page two. When you do that, the camera is going to let you know that the calibration is underway. You need to do two things. You need to rotate the camera about its vertical axis. So we're going to spin it nice and slow about its vertical axis. And then we're also going to tumble the camera about its horizontal axis. I'm doing this uh, faster than you should, just for sake of time here. Once that's complete, we'll press the display button, and then the red LED light on the compass module is going to flash rapidly, letting us know that it is calibrating that compass. Once it stops flashing and goes to a solid red, go ahead and power the camera off and then back on. And now your compass is calibrated. In order to further refine the compass calibration for use of the laser rangefinder and locating the location of an object in distance, we're going to use a couple of uh, tools here. One is a field expedient compass calibration card. Here is a, uh, a piece of cardboard that I've used to draw intersecting lines at 90 degree angles. We also have lensatic compass. When we place the components on the ground, we go ahead and take a lensatic compass, we place it along the vertical line, we take our camera and we place it along the intersecting horizontal line. We read the heading off the lensatic compass as reading 045, and the camera right now is reading 048 degrees. So in this case I'll go ahead and refine the compass calibration by calibrating one more time and to see if we can improve our accuracy. Depending on your mission requirements, you may need to recalibrate a couple times to refine that compass heading. Or if you're using it more for just general situation awareness of which direction you're taking the photo, then one calibration will be sufficient because you're going to get the idea of which direction you're looking at. 